Forrester. McLaughlin. Keating's making a run. Cavan is in the middle. Nolan's on the far side as they look from that side of the pitch, if that makes sense. Forrester slips it through for Keating. A decent save by Barr. Yeah, it's good football all around from St. Pat's. Nice and patient build up. As soon as Chris Forrester gets on the ball, that's when you know you need to start making your runs. Forrester picks it up, drives it off that wing, sees the run of Keaton. But now, Breslin. Breslin. Nolan. Nolan with the pullback. And draw to deal with it. Bulger intercepts. Great flick to Bulger from Breslin. Now it's Nolan who is onside. Nolan's cross. Keating couldn't direct it on target, but it wasn't a bad effort. Yeah, this is much better for St. Pat's. The tempo, the energy is there. The quality in the passing. Really good football. Bulger picks up the ball here. You can see he wants to get it to Nolan. Delays the pass really well. Good ball in. Rory Keaton needs to try and stay within the win. One all between Bohemians and Shamrock Rovers. Kenny has equalised for Rovers. He's having a fine season, the Sligo man. Still on loan from Celtic. And still getting better every time I see him. Here's Keating. Kavanagh. Tried to find Keating and does. Keating. Still Keating. Keating! What a goal! A great slip through ball by Kavanagh. Matched by a great finish from Keating. Pats 1 0 up against Strahada. Keating's third of the season. It's no more than Pats deserve, to be fair. Been the better team. It's a brilliant play by Kavanagh. Picks it up. He knows Deegan can't quite get there. Slips him in. And as you think, Keaton is going to take the shot on that right foot. Chops back in on his left. As soon as he opens up the goal on that left foot, you just expect him to hit the back of the net. Makes it look easy. Brilliant finish from Keaton. Here comes the corner. Flicked on. Oh, they're unlucky. Drada Piro just couldn't keep his feet, and it goes wide. Came off the woodwork. Heart and mouth time for St. Pat's. Pat's living really dangerously. This is why it's important they clean up in the final third. Very, very close. Was it seed in the equaliser? It was Quinn. He was so close. Marky shadowing him. Bulger, Forrester. A misty night in Intercore. Oh, that's a really good turn by Levy, who's recovered well. Keating's waiting in the middle. Keating lays it off. Great save by Barr. Fantastic save. Draw it out for a corner, but it should be 2 0 Pats. Yeah, he took the words out of my mouth, though, saying it should be 2 0 to Pats. Again, the build of play is brilliant. Some really sil slick football in there. Levy with his torn is excellent. Don't quite get it in the replay. Keaton, the ball is behind him. Takes the right up. High and in. Can goes for it, doesn't get to it. Deegan. Deegan back outside. It's a dipping ball, flicked on by Foley, comes back to him. Can. Air. Oh, Quinn. Well, Can had a go, but he fresh aired it. It fell to Quinn. Quinn couldn't keep it down. Draw had a score as St. Pat's relieved. Um, it's a lovely ball in. There's a couple of appeals for the penalty as well. This strike here, they're saying that hits the, the arm. I think it's torn up. Not too sure from that replay, but Quinn should be doing an awful lot better there. Davis. Davis. Can really dribble with the ball and pass and Piro. Close the ground. Referee says nothing doing. And here's Kavanagh. We'll have a look at that in a second. Kavanagh, Levy, Levy up against Can, still Levy, still Levy, Can does really well, Weir, it's up and down isn't it? Yeah it's turned into an end to end game which I think suits Strotter to that little bit more. And similar enough to the Knicks against Philadelphia last night in the NBA playoffs, here's Davis, Davis, it's dipping but it's okay for Rodgers. Done that once or twice in this game, Davis, hasn't he? Just gone on a little mazy. Lovely little run there as well. So here's the penalty shout. Got busy, Davis. A mismatch in size there, but he didn't mind two former teammates, of course. Here come Pats. Keating's in the middle. Can they find him? Pats still with it. Nice turn by Nolan. Nolan shot it deflected and bounces into the path of bar, but did it deflect up an arm. He didn't buy it. Here's Marky. 
Now, did this strike an arm? Nolan shot after some great play down that left hand side. Oh, I think it definitely hits oh, his yeah. arm. No, it did. That's a penalty. Bit of it coming together. Here comes the exo set. Bauer tries to head it on. It's a pat head that gets to it. Then Deegan. A bouncing shot that just didn't find its way through. Kavanagh and Keating and Levy are all there, but it's Markey who wins it. Markey. Now it's Davis. Davis a shot. Davis. So close. Oh, draw it really close again. It's Darren Markey goes and nicks the ball by draw it in the middle of the pitch. Here you see, it's a foul. He does really well. Davis comes back in on that right foot. Thought he's got it on target, just drags it ever so slowly. And it almost dropped for Quinn, but it was Turner who got it away. And Mulraney who carries. Keating has to make sure he's onside and does. Still Mulraney, lots of support arriving. Lots of numbers in the box. Here's Mulraney's cross, right foot for Forrester. And Barr makes the save. Position up here, just wanted it a little bit quicker. Kavanagh gets on the ball, this is the one. Jake Mulraney getting down the line. We talked about his delivery, his delivery's on the money there. Up in the air it goes. Keeley's watching it all the way, but Bauer gets a good flick onto Pirro, who moves inside to Deegan, and he is a runner out the right, that's Heaney. And now draw to load the box, Heaney. Bauer didn't get anything on it. Oh, he got enough maybe for Pirro. Oh. Actually, he did get something on it. I kind of lost it in the lights or something, but wasn't the cleanest of strikes. It bounced invitingly for Pirro, who I think got something on it, but just not enough. Let's have another look. This one needs to be slowed down. Well, it does for me, anyway. Pats have got away with one here. Oh, pulls him there. Oh, he does. He gets something on it. Rogers away from him in the end, but Forrester is able to rescue it. St. Patrick's Athletic have got the win that they desperately, desperately wanted. They worked hard for it. They earned it the hard way. Keating strike in the first half. The difference. St. Pat's won. Drogheda United nil.